This is my fire extinguisher tank and solenoid valve air cannon that I usually show in the air cannon videos. Today I took my caliber 410 aluminum barrel and I've rifled it with the rifling reamer I made. So what I want to do in this video is see if my slugs are exiting the barrel and traveling point first and spin stabilized. Let's find out. Ammunition for this test will be these cast lead slugs shown here. Test firing distance is 10 meters. Shot number one. Last test shot. The three lead slugs I fired from my newly rifled caliber 410 air cannon barrel all appear to have uh, struck point first. The point is completely smashed off each slug. They didn't mushroom because they're a fairly hard lead alloy. They obviously struck point first, so my rifling must have worked. Here's a quick look at three of my homemade uh, barrel rifling reamers for barrels, of course, that are made of softer material than steel. These will work on copper, uh, aluminum, or uh, hard plastic. This one is the one I use to rifle the caliber 410 barrel that I just tested in the video. There's sort of a, a look at it. The middle one I use to rifle the caliber 565 copper barrel that I've shown in a previous video. This one is for my caliber 812 copper barrels. I'm not quite finished cutting this reamer. It's nearly there, and then when I'm done it, I will show a caliber 812 rifled copper barrel. 